We asked Gary Graham of Honeymoon Suite why their keyboardist, Ray Colburn, left the band after the second album. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Canada. We should point out that Ray did come back after he left, but he's not in the current lineup of Honeymoon Suite. We talked about that with Gary Graham. Why did Ray leave the first time? Did he just want to do his own thing? I know he came back, but wh why did he? Um, Ray was really unhappy with, he did not like the management or the manager. Um, and he, yeah, exactly. He thought that he could do better on his own. He got to a point where I he thought, well, you know, I'm kind of semi-famous. I don't need this now. I can like go and I'm sure I'll get in another band and do all this other stuff. And I think he made a huge mistake, yeah. but you know, you can't stop somebody who's, who's not happy and I don't want them there if they're not happy. So, uh, you know, Ray's his own, uh, I think that he wanted to be more in charge of things and, uh, you know, maybe we would have started butting heads eventually cause he raised a great writer, but he's a keyboard player and going off in a different direction than I wanted to. I remember I was interviewing Glass Tiger in Toronto. They were doing a photo shoot or a video. I forget. I was so young and scared. It doesn't matter. And they're, and I was interviewing their drummer. He, they were all doing stuff, and he came over, and he says, well, I'm going to leave the band. Going, the first album, uh, you, probably, you probably know the guy. I forget his name. Michael Hansen, yeah. Yeah, I remember going, are you crazy? I mean, I never – and I was really scared during that interview because I'd never done an on-person. I was like maybe 24. And he says, yeah, I'm going to leave the band, do my own thing. I'm going – what the hell can I, and you, as you can imagine, you run into it. I run into it all the time of, of being with people and I'm having to ask a musician, do you regret that move? You know, and, yeah. and because, uh, it, and listen, I just interviewed John Anderson, uh, Ian Anderson, a Jethro Tull, Steve Hackett, formerly of Genesis. And I ask him, why do you guys not get along? Like, not quite like that, but you and Johnny have been together and, and now Dave is back. You guys yeah, yeah. have been together a long time. Yeah, well, as far as guys leaving the band, I mean, you have to understand that I always knew you get probably get one shot at it in yeah. this business, one chance. So you don't get two or three. Some people do. So when it's your shot, you just better, you know, stick it out and don't uh, like Michael Hansen leaving that band after one album. Again, that's just that's crazy. You know, you have your opportunity and you think the grass is greener, but it, it's not. But anyways, you know, you can go on all day about that. Yeah. But as far as us, uh, again, we got lucky with the personalities. Uh, Dave and Gary did leave for a while in the 90s when things were uh, – the 90s came along and killed melodic rock yeah. bands like us. So we had to lay low for many years. Uh, Johnny and I always kept it together. But then uh, we had these side guys, and we were playing gigs, and they were really good players, but it wasn't the same. He didn't play the songs just exactly the same. So at some point I said to Johnny, let's try and get Dave and Gary and, and Ray back. Let's try and put it back together because I saw a lot of these other bands, with the original guys. I'm, uh, I'm all about being a band and we have uh, a thing, a sound that we make when it's only the five of us or the four of us on stage. We've had other players, but it's never the same. So that's, they, they came back. It's been that way for like, I don't know, 10, 15 years now. And nobody's thinking of leaving and we're happy. So it's chemistry and friendship. And you wouldn't believe, especially me and Johnny, after what, 35 years. Crazy. I yeah. know. Yeah. Make sure you comment on our videos, subscribe to our channel and share our videos. And buy a t-shirt, help support our channel. Link in the description of this video.